loose no matter how far. Hey everyone, my name is Hal. This is Quail Studios Guitar. Today we're going to do Nothing Else Matters, Metallica. What you just heard was the way I learned how to play it just from listening to it and figuring it out by ear very quickly. I had a deadline I had to meet and so uh, I had to just do it as fast as I could and I got most of it right. You know what I mean? The way they do it. Uh, this is how I play it and how I play it a lot of times. And I haven't ever sat down and figured out exactly what they do because it seems like I'm always on a time crunch to be able to get something done very quickly, learn a whole bunch of songs very quickly, but you know, when I started playing it, you said, that is nothing else matters because this is the beginning part that really counts, right? Here we go. Let's zoom in and I'll show you what to do. First of all, let's talk about the chords. We're gonna start with an E minor chord. I'll show you the right hand in just a minute. And then we're going to do an A minor chord. A chord that I call C with the B bass. And then C. D. And then we go back to E minor. We also have a G that we're playing. I don't usually use that finger. I usually mute that A string with this finger right here. B7. I find the B7 to be a really good chord to use in this song. And let's see, are there any other? Oh yes, there's an A chord. I like to use one fingered A chord. Some people like to do it this way. I love to use my one, my first finger. Looks like this. All right, let's move on to the right hand. Starting with the E minor chord up here and starting with the first figure that we do, What's nice about this is that you don't actually have to even put your fingers down there. But it's a good idea in case you spill over into some of the other strings. If you don't have your fingers down, it might sound like, won't sound very good, but really, just like that. Okay, so that's the picking pattern that I'm using. One, two, three, four, five, six, one, two, three. I'm using my thumb, my index, my middle, my ring on thumb on E, index on G string, middle on the B string, ring finger on the E string, high E. I love to do it this way. That's my right hand, something like that. I kind of messed up on a couple of the chords. So we got that E minor chord. Here, let's zoom out a little bit so we can get both hands. There we go.
Now, you can do this several different ways, really, and get the right effect, because everyone will love it when you play it. Um, you don't have to play it exactly like Metallica does, but it's nice to get close, and it's nice to do exactly what they do, but if you're kind of a beginner and you just need to learn how to play the chords and go from chord to chord, then don't worry too much about the exact intricacies to begin with. You can uh, hone that in later and get more precise as you go. So what we do, one, two, three, you do this four times, one, two, three, seventh fret, So I'm doing an 8 pull off to 7, slide down to 5. That tab will be, you know, definitely in my book. A minor, C with a B bass, C. That's a pull off from three to open. D chord, second fret pull off, and then open B to five, like that, hammer on. And then we play open E and then harmonic, harmonic, harmonic. And then we play open string, open string going this way. do this four times then you go oh I forgot this chord check it out I'll put the chord right there E minor and then a D chord this is a bar chord on the fifth fret and then C bar chord <laughs> I forgot this in the beginning when I was doing the chords. And then back to the E minor. Seventh fret. We did this again, E minor, D. Now on this chord right here, when I'm playing it the third time, I like to pull back this way. G chord. B7 and then to E minor four times so close no matter how far one two three four five six D chord two three so we play the D note G string and those three and then C chord or something like that maybe that's better and then E minor so it's like one two three four five six one two three one two three one two three four five six D chord C chord E minor D, C, G for three beats, B7 for three beats, E minor. You do this two times. Verse two. Never open myself this way. Life is ours, we live it our way. Now this is not a cover. All these words I don't just say. I sing the words just to give you a place to understand where I am in the music. And nothing else matters. So all these verses are the same. Trust I seek and I find in you. Every day for us something new. Open mind for a different view. And nothing else matters. 
let's go back and pull out my pick. Because what if you can't finger pick very well and you're still working on it? We could do... One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three, four, five. You can do it with your pick. So close, no matter how far. Couldn't be much more from the heart. Forever trusting who we are And nothing else matters Never open myself this way Life is ours, we live it our way And so that's the way you do it, okay? So you do verse 1, verse 2, verse 3. Then we get to the chorus, right? Let's see, um, nothing else matters. Third verse. Let's see, G. And nothing else matters. C. Now we strum it once. One, two, three. One, two, three. Never cared for what they do. Never cared for what they know. But I know. So after that chorus, you go right back into the verse. Verse 1. And when you get done with that, you go back into the chorus, right? And nothing else matters. C. A. Never cared for what they do. Never cared for what they know. And I know. Right there, it starts on the lead. One, two, three, four. Now, A minor. C, G, four, five, six, D. E minor. Three, four, five, six. One, two, three. And then it, the progression starts over. You do it twice. back into verse 2. Never open myself this way. Life is ours, we live it our way. All these words I don't just say. And not, wait, B7. Nothing else matters. Verse 3. Seek and I find Every day for us something new Open mind for a different view And G, going to B7, E minor, C, A And this chorus is like twice as long as the, the other two choruses Never cared for what they say Never cared for games they play Never cared for what they do. D. Never cared for what they C. A. D. And I know. Now you play the lead, but the verse chords are played instead of the intro chords. Two, three, four, five, six, one, two, three. Just like verse two. Actually, all the verses are the same, right? And we sing verse one one more time. So close, no matter how far, could be much more from the heart. Forever trusting. And 
I don't know how many times they do this, I think. Then we go, oops, sorry. Do it again. Something like that, and that's how I end it. Thank you for being here. My name is Hal, Quail Studios Guitar. I think I already said that. I do have a Patreon page if you want to become a patron. I do have a subscribe star page in case you want to be a subscriber. In the description is a PayPal link where you can donate to me directly and then um, I can send you, put you on my email list and send you links to Hangouts and to videos that I do that are unlisted, that nobody else can see, just like at Subscribestar on Patreon. And uh, also you can get my book, Quail Studios Music and Lead Sheets with theory in the back. All right, talk to you later. See ya, bye. Mm -hmm.